Hello everyone, Namaskar, Rajkrishna this side. Let's solve a question which appeared in gate exam 2014. The function fx equals to e power x minus 1 is to be solved using Newton Repson method. If the initial value of x naught is taken 1, then the absolute error observed at the second iteration. So function is e power x minus 1 because Newton Repson we are using. So we need e uh, the derivative also which will come out to be e power x. Okay. Now what is uh, because they are asking absolute error. So one which we, we can solve normally finding a root of e power x minus 1 we will find that that is your exact value and your approximate value you will get from Newton Epson method okay so you will take their difference and uh, take the absolute value of that that is what they are asking so let's uh, take the first iteration which will be x naught which is 1 minus value of function at x naught so value of function at 1 so that will be e power 1 minus 1 let's use the calculator so e power 1 e power 1 minus 1 so that value is 1.718282 obviously the derivative is 1 more than that okay so that will be 2.718282 which is the value of e itself so x1 you are getting is 1 minus this is 1.718282 and down we have 2.718282. You are getting it as 0 0.367879. Now let's jump in to find the value of x2 which will be 0 0.367879 minus. Now you need to find uh, e power this thing so e power 0 0.367879 and uh, this minus 1 so this minus 1 this is giving you 0 0.44667 44667 and divided by because the down value which is the derivative that will be one more than this so I am simply writing 1.444667 and now I have to calculate the entire value which is 0 0.367879 minus this uh, 0 0.444667 divided by 1.444667 so this is giving me 0 0.6 uh, 0 0.060080 and that's what I need because this is the value of x2 now if I were to find the absolute error that will be nothing but 0 0.60 this is the absolute error that will be obviously the mod of 0 0.06 sorry this will be 0 0.060080 minus 0 okay even if you do the opposite because you are taking mod that will not matter okay so if they want up to two decimal places depending on whatever they want you will get 0 0.06 okay so depending upon what they 
wanted a number of decimal places they have not mentioned but depending on whatever they wanted this is what uh, we have the iterative formula let's uh, recap this uh, for newton reaction method the iterative formula is xn plus 1 is xn minus value of function at xn divided by value of derivative at xn this is the newton Repson form uh, method iterative formula so i hope you understood this problem uh, we'll see you with more problems like this uh, till then you can watch out the playlist and other videos as well thanks again